What's going on, beautiful people? Happy Wednesday to you all. Uh, real quick, in this video, I want to review the Harmony One project. Uh, I'm just going to really quick go over staking, wallet setup, um, and just how to earn some free tokens and additional tokens on a balance that you may already have that's just sitting anyways. Um, so let's just go ahead and jump right into it. Of course, all the links that you need for this video will be provided for you under uh, the video or above the video. I'm not sure how Discord posts it. Uh, this is the Harmony One website. Uh, definitely recommend checking out the project, checking out, seeing what they got going on, guys. Uh, there's a lot happening as far as development, uh, building on the ecosystem. Uh, they're giving you a little bit of comparison, showing you the speed, the efficiency, um, you know, but definitely look at it, guys. It's a project that I've uh, actually owned for a while and it's still really cheap, only four cents and it's just own blockchain uh, as you can see major partners listed on a lot of different exchanges um, so what we're gonna do is you're gonna basically go all the way down here staking dashboard select staking dashboard uh, I'm already logged into mine so when you normally go it'll ask you to sign in or create a wallet uh, it's gonna give you a couple different options to create a web wallet uh, to use your MetaMask the Harmony one wallet or trust wallet or a Binance wallet uh, a couple of them that I have interacted with on this um, I have used up here the Harmony One wallet, which is the wallet that I'm currently using right now uh, to store my Harmony One. Uh, you can use MetaMask. However, you need to make sure your MetaMask is set to the Binance uh, BS, BNB, uh, the Binance Smart Chain Network, uh, or you can use the Binance uh, Chain wallet itself. A uh, really cool feature about this wallet, which I'll do in a separate video, it's essentially like having Binance, um, just a decentralized wallet. Uh, the only thing to it is you're required to only trade in BNB. So other than like, unlike Binance, where you can use USDT, Ether, Bitcoin, that wallet you can only use, only use uh, BNB, but the great thing is, it's just like having a Binance account. All the tokens listed on Binance, even the new high risk, um, the ones that are in their, what do they call it? Their, their Binance Labs, development labs, you can trade all of those. And a lot of those are under a penny, guys. Uh, but back to Harmony One. So once you download the wallet and you set up your profile and everything, uh, it'll look like this. I already have a little bit of Harmony already being staked. Uh, I'm going to save the rest of the stake for you for guys right now uh, for the purpose of this video. A couple things that we always remind you of when staking that you need to look for when you're selecting a self-staking validator. Again, if you're staking in Trust Wallet or you're staking in Atomic Wallet, uh, you don't need to do these things. Uh, the wallets are automatic uh, protected validators and they will stake for you. If you're staking on Binance or the exchange, same thing. You don't have to do this. Only if you stake from your private wallets um, are you going to need to look at these things. One thing we always want to look at is uptime. These guys down here with 59, 96, stay away from those. We can't give our tokens to people who are not going to be running validators 100% of the time and giving us the opportunity to earn 100% return uh, on our money while the, while the nodes are up and running. All right, so you always want to see nodes who are 100% uh, is what you want to look for. You can go as low as maybe 98 if you have to. Uh, one thing I would say is be careful with fees. However, most uh, of these delegators, if they provide a fee, uh, it's usually because of a substitute, uh, meaning they may charge you 5% of, uh, of the staking fee that you would normally be rewarded, but they'll sub that 5% for another token. So meaning, hey, we're gonna take this 5% in one token you were supposed to get, but we're gonna airdrop you 5% of our token on top of the difference. So you'll get 3% in one, 5% in whatever other token they're offering. Uh, but again, a good way to look at this, you just click on the delegator, it'll bring you up the information about them. You can click on the developer, deve um, the delegator's website, uh, and you can see more information on them, guys. Uh, and as you can see here, uh, this one has been rising in, in, in delegation. All right, so what do I wanna look and see? I wanna see where, you know, you can look and see different ones. Who's got the most staking? Uh, what chains are staking the most? You can see right now, the most is on KuCoin. Uh, so KuCoin is a heavy validator of this. Uh, Binance here as well. Um, so those things you, you do like to see. Uh, I already stuck, uh, staked part of my, um, part of mine with them right now. So it's earning the 8%, uh, they're at 99. Uh, there was another one that I was just gonna choose. Uh, this one right here, uh, they charge a 10% fee, which is fairly high guys, uh, but they're giving you, when you click on it, it tells you. All right, so Fuzzy Swap, a uh, swap platform that gives you incentive to use. You stake your uh, with the Fuzzy Validator and they give you Fuzz Token. So they're going to charge me 10%, but they're going to pay me out in this new token, whatever the token is. So if you're not really sure, you can click on the website, 
and see what they got to offer. So what is Fuzz? Looks like another setup of another decentralized wallet, of another possible token swap. This looks a lot like Pancake, Pancake Swap and Uniswap. Might be a little interested. So I'm gonna go ahead and delegate a little bit to them. So let's go ahead and give them, we'll give them 400, all right? So we'll go ahead and do that delegation. Please transaction signed in, confirm sign. Gotta do my password really quick. All right, and that's it guys. Just like that, you simply, that's all you gotta do and your harmony will be staked. Transaction is successful. We go back to the dashboard and there you go. I've got 900 harmony one staking right now. Uh, 600 left available. I'll go ahead and probably just delegate that out too. Uh, normally don't like delegating my whole balance, but it's a little cheapy coin, only at four cents. Uh, so risk, risk to reward, I'm okay with that. Uh, so again, we'll just find another little cheapy one. Uh, we'll look and see what they have to offer. Uh, highest uptime on two nodes, minus key, delegate, da 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 da, how many one? Easy, stick with us, best experience. Nothing too crazy. Uh, for the most part, I'll look and I'll find somebody um, who's offering additional tokens. Uh, Cause right now, if I'm gonna stake that small balance, only like $200 worth, uh, I wanna find the way to maximize it. So if I can get free tokens airdropped uh, for future sales, um, you know, to just wash in the Bitcoin, why not? Uh, anyways, guys, hopefully that video was helpful. Just wanted to show you another way to earn passive income with another one of the trade ideas uh, that we put in the room for you. And we'll catch you guys on the next video.